Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body old school for low. Purple rim, seven seven cutty, black right. with the purple strip. What's good, Ravens fam? So I'm sorry about the little lighting, as you can see. The sun is very in my eyes right now, but um, just want to do a quick, quick video and talk to you all about Odafi Owe and Ojabo. Now the presser was uh, the presser was yesterday, and y'all know I, I, I joke about Owe with his what two, three sacks, something like that, but um. On the real, um, I'm hoping I'm hoping both of them be productive. Really, um, Owe played what like two, maybe three games from the injury last year. It's going, it's going, it's going to be good to see two friends from from high school, from where they're at. You know, play on the field with each other. You know what I'm saying? It's it's like we all we all we we all dreamed of that playing some type of sport. With our best friend. And like they're. They are living that dream. They're on the same team. And they be on. Gets to be on this field. At the same time with each other. Like that is. That's wild. I'm hoping they dominate. I'm just hoping they dominate. OA got so much promise. Hopefully he's getting with someone. To work. The quote unquote sack. Sack leader they working with. Hopefully they just can put it all together. And just man. Just make it. Just make it really. Just make it beautiful. It's been so long since the Ravens. Have had them sack monsters. Like. Suggs. Smith. Judon. It's just been a long time. I can't even think of the other name. Uh, he played with Suggs, too. Came from Denver. They say the fax machine messed up. I cannot think of his name right now, y'all. My apologies. Brother just got out for work. As you can see, my, my shirt is right behind me. But just I'm just, man, I'm just hoping they do so good. Like, like I know I joke around. I probably joke around when the season start, but... We all know it's just fun and games on my side. It's just fun and games. But I'm really hoping they they, they do really good. Like Odab o, o, Ojabo, like this pretty much, in my opinion, this is like his rookie year to me. Cause he really didn't get to do anything last year. And Obe dude picked in the first round. Um Part of the Orlando Brown Jr. You know, pick. So, just got a man, you know. Had Justin Houston as his Yoda, as he called him, teaching him. Justin Houston might not be back this year. We don't know. If he does come back, it's cool to me. I ain't going to be one of them people that be tripping. He'll be back to me as that, that mentor. Because I believe a veteran has to be somewhere on the team to me at least in each spot like obj wide receivers lamar's already a veteran offensive line got plenty of veterans Ronnie stanley stuff like that defensive line michael pierce veterans you see what i'm saying roquan smith linebacker veteran safeties you got marcus williams you got marlon humphrey in the corner veterans see that that's just my opinion that's just my opinion but if he does come back, you know, that's cool. He can teach Ojabo some more stuff. Spend more time with these boys. Hopefully they getting uh getting to work with them in the off season. Trying to learn some things. Cause I, I want I want to see that pressure. And a lot of football is on the defensive side is getting that pressure, helping the cornerbacks. The faster the the, the linebackers, the defensive ends can get that pressure on that quarterback, the easier the cornerback's job can be. So that's just just my quick opinion. So tell me what y'all think. Also, if you have any questions, ask them in the comments so I can answer them on my series question from comments. Also, before also also hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the share.
Everybody stay safe and God bless.